Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Earthworm Jim 3D. In the last episode, we did the final level, the good, the bad, and the elderly. And in this episode, we're going to fight the last world boss, Bob the Goldfish. And this is the only time Bob the Goldfish is a somewhat th threat. Because in the first game, you kind of just tapped him, and the second game, you didn't have to move to kill him. Uh, this might be a shorter episode because I don't think I want to stick the final boss in this episode too because right after this is the final boss. So this episode might be one of the shorter ones I do. Pork boarding. So Bob in number four. And Jim actually said pork boarding again. So here he is. Well, I don't, I don't know if I can do a Bob the Goldfish voice, but I'm going to try. Welcome to the final showdown, Jimmy. It's time to earn your spurs. Subaquatic evildoer, I will sink you and your pet. Look into my eyes, oh mighty worm. I am the goldfish of doom. By the power of my super suit, and with the help of my trusty swine, I'll save this brain and send you to a watery grave. Alright, Bob. So, like every other boss, it's the same shit. Except with one different thing. So, let's see if we can see it. Well, we didn't see it there. <laughs> kind of just got obliterated. But what Bob does, different from other bosses, is that Bob is actually able to avoid your missiles. He can jump. So if you shoot a missile, Bob is going to jump over it. So. Like that. And I just wanted to show it off. So, the way to do it is you have to fire a missile pretty much one after another. So he'll get hit by the next one. You don't want to delay it too much or else it just won't hit. You also don't want to shoot it too close because I think it'll just miss. I do want to get all these straggler marbles. I do say that it's probably going to be the shortest episode, but who knows? It might take a while. Sometimes you get lucky and actually hit him twice. Give me all those marbles, Bob. You don't need this shit. I've only beaten this boss like too many fucking times. Whoa, I actually avoided it jumping off a ramp. I never avoid missiles when I jump off of ramps unless I'm really lucky. Oh, come on. Um, there's also the boost here, but again, I don't use the boost. I just pick it up just so Bob doesn't take it. Bob's annoying. Because <laughs> they're... Because the bosses... Have more use with the boost than you do. Funnily enough. Ugh. Slow down so you don't get... Blasted by that. Again, I, I can't really think of a use for the boost on these bosses. Except the final boss, because I use it quite a bit there. In case I mess up. Speaking of messing up, we're probably going to mess up on Bob. I'll be able to kill him quickly. Because he was swimming right close to me. That didn't even, that didn't even try. Whoa. Bob just leaping from this. Ugh. Ugh, this could be the shortest episode. <laughs> what the? F what is he doing? He's just like he's trying to escape the game. Oh, I got him! I blast him. These are mine, Bob. Fuck off! No fish has use for marbles. Oh, nice, 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 nice. You did pick some up. <sighs> Gotta just listen for the missile, because you never know. Some people could do these bosses quickly. I, I can't. On the PC version, I can. 
Oh, no. Bob does a ton of damage. Jesus. I guess I forgot to mention, because I really haven't gotten hit often. Uh, the bosses do increase their damage output as you keep going. Oh, come on. Ah! Damn it. Come on, Bob. Why you gotta do this to me? How could you do this to me? I made my mistakes. And blah, 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 blah. I wanna die to Bob. Please. Dying to Bob is... Sad. <laughs> It's gonna happen. I'm gonna die to Bob. That's what's gonna happen. He's got one marble. I gotta pick those up, because I need health. You were the joke boss for so long, Bob, and now you're actually like a threat, so it scares me. What? I jumped. I jumped. I died. I died. I actually died to Bob. Well, that's great. <laughs> I, I did not expect to die to Bob, honestly. I just ate my fucking words. Alright, well, I guess I'll just keep the recording going. I'm probably just going to cut till I'm close to beating him because you kind of get the gist of this fight. It's pretty much like every other fight except Bob is annoying, I guess. Oh! Ah! Got it. Okay, cool. At least when he's when his ship starts smoking, he doesn't jump anymore. So that's nice. Took less time than the initial uh, fight, I guess. So that's cute. It's still going to be a relatively short episode because the final boss is going to. Ugh, final boss, the final boss. But, you know, next part we'll get into that. So that's it for the fantasy world, and with that, the game's done. Also, to fight Bob, you do need 950 marbles. So, just putting that out there. But back outside, let's, uh... Let's go talk to Peter. We haven't talked to Peter since, uh, beginning of the game. Jump cut. I really hate to do a jump cut there. But um, basically, Peter just disappeared, and it opened up the path. Um, if you have all the udders and all the marbles, uh, this path will open up and Peter will disappear. Sometimes he doesn't disappear, and sometimes he just stays here. It's a, it's a glitch. I think it's only in the PC version, but I think it happened once in the N64 version. I don't remember. But next time on Earthworm Jim 3D, we are going to fight the final boss. Oh, man. The final boss is going to suck. <sighs> but we'll get into that next episode. See you guys for the finale. <laughs>